Hello there folks, greetings to each and every one of you. This video is going to be a bit different from all the others. Um, it is a kind of a chart I've compiled and I'll explain it to you. Well, I've been looking online, various sources, and it says in the United States of America there has been 63 million abortions since... Um, Roe since um, yeah Roe versus Wade um, went through the courts legalizing abortion sixty three million in Britain there's been ten million and all these unwanted pregnancies how can we stop all these unwanted pregnancies in the first place so I'm gonna make I'm gonna I've made this chart for young women and I I know I'm gonna probably get comments saying I'm being patronizing this that and the other blah 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 stop telling us what to do. Just put your emotions to a, to a side and let me explain this and it'll all make sense, all right? So, at the top of this chart, okay, you're in your early 20s, you're a young lady, um, you see a lad you like and uh, he becomes your boyfriend, okay? Could you envision him as a future husband? Really, really think of Could you really see him as a future husband? And I think you should only be in a relationship with a man, a young man, who you see as a future husband. If not, remain as friends or stay away. Look, if you're in your early 20s and you go to a nightclub and you see this bad boy who's got three kids from two different women, chances are he's not going to commit and stick to you. It's as simple as that. Stay away from them, fellas. Stay away from anyone like that who just wants you for you know what. Stay away from any lad like that. You know, no ifs, buts or maybes. I don't care how nice his car is or his jewellery or his possessions or his, how nice his house is. If he's a playboy or anyone like that, a bad boy, stay away, all right? It's as simple as that. But let's say, yes, you would see him as a future husband. He seems nice, but he wishes to sleep with you. It's been three months on. No mention of engagement or marriage or anything like that. What do you say? Let's say you say no. Congratulations. You've got some self-respect there. Good on you. Right, I'm going to work my way down. He applies pressure on you. Stay in all his friends or in sexual relationships and they're all doing great. And now he's starting to com question your commitment to him. Do you buckle under the pressure? I mean, he's a nice lad. He, he could be a future husband. A few times wouldn't hurt. Come on, come on. But let's say you say no again. He claims, <laughs> he claims if you really love him, you'll sleep with him just a few times, just a few times. And he threatens to end the relationship. Do you yield? Do you still say no? Come on, he's a really nice guy. He's treated you so well. He's taking you to dinner, the cinema. He's taking you on a few day trips here and there. He has treated you like a queen. Just a few times. Then you get married to him. But you still say no? Congratulations. You, young lady, have got a lot of self-respect. You keep on to that course, you will find that man. You will find that great man who will respect you. He is out there. But let's say... First time round... You say yes to sleeping with him. Or maybe not to begin with. He puts the pressure on. Say yes. But he's threatening to break up the relationship. You say yes. Most... <laughs> I put that... Most premarital relationships... Involving sex are doomed to failure, higher rates of abortion, sexually transmitted diseases, unwanted children. And ladies, this is really vitally important. And this never goes away for the rest of your life. You will gain a reputation. I'm not going to use any of those nasty words, but that is it. That is it in a nutshell. If you're a young lady... You're still a virgin. 
please, please, please save your virginity for your wedding day. And you'll look back in years to come. You'll look, watch this video and you say, yeah, Paul Tracy makes sense. I only want the best for you. You can ask any Christian lady, especially an older Christian lady, about this chart. Watch this video and they'll say to you, yes. Speaking a lot of sense here. All right, I'll wrap this up. You take care. God bless you all. Please like and subscribe. <laughs> and bye for now.